Tonight, Arizona is home to the world's largest ponderosa pine forest, but new research is finding that the forests are drying up. Team Trolls Colleen Sikora is looking at that study and what the future holds for the trees. The study is finding that the ponderosa pines here in Arizona have fared better in the mega drought because of the monsoon, but it still finds that these trees are stressed. The vast ponderosa pines in Tonto National Forest. Very important indeed. Just some of the ponderosas in the Southwest. All the plants on the surface of the earth when they are taking up carbon, these forests have been shown to be a considerable aspect of that. But for 23 years, University of Arizona research scientist so Brandon so Strange high. says they've been affected by the mega drought. If we get a really insane heat wave, you know, one year, or the monsoon does not show up, that is kind of going to compound with their already high drought stress and, and really be bad for the forest. Strange and his research partners are finding in a new study the Ponderosa pine forests that do not get as much rain from the North American monsoon are faring worse. They have a lot of drought stress and they're kind of starting to dry up. One of the ways that Ponderosa pines react in drought is to close off their pine needles to hold in water for when it's dry and hot, but the mega drought has stressed them further. It's so hot and so dry that despite their kind of best efforts, they're, they're still losing a ton of water to the atmosphere. It kind of reduces how well they function in general. So it kind of makes them more susceptible to mortality. Those like the pines in Arizona. They really need that moisture to come in. Are getting some relief from the monsoon, but. They're still doing quite poorly, kind of on a similar trajectory as those other forests, but just a little bit behind because they do have that kind of built in buffer with the, the North American monsoon. Strange isn't expecting the drought alone to kill off the trees, but the future of the Ponderosa pines, Strange says, are dependent on two unpredictable things, the ongoing drought and what happens with the monsoon. The future for these forests and for their drought stress is really uncertain right now. And potential further impacts uncertain too. If these trees are constantly stressed out, they're not going to be as productive or remove as much carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. Making the monsoon and other precipitation all that more important. In Payson, Colleen Sikora, 12 News.